I'm a male model and this is everything I eat in a day. I usually start the morning off, keep it simple. I either go with oatmeal, I do two instant packets and then I add some protein powder to it. And then I'll have a muffin there as well. And if I don't do this, I do some like high protein yogurt, get some, get some berries, get some granola, make a little parfait kind of thing. I do that whenever I don't do the oatmeal thing. Also, for what it's worth, I'm a pretty skinny, lean individual, so I'm doing a bit of bulking, so this is actually going to be eating more calories than you regularly would because I've been hitting the gym a lot and I need to, for one, keep up that energy, but also I'm trying to bulk up a bit. So I'm that. So this is the diet that I'm doing to do that. I'm not trying to go like hardcore 4,000 calories in a day or anything. I'm just trying to bulk up a little bit, kind of like a lean bulk type situation. So that's what we got going on. And then throughout the day, I'll have some snacks, have a couple apples, some crackers, some maybe like a little charcuterie board type thing around lunch, or I'll make a spinach egg cheese wrap type thing. I've had the Starbucks spinach feta egg white wrap things, and those gave me the idea for these two eggs, a little bit of milk, scramble them up, add some, I'll get some like prosciutto, add that in there, cook that up until it's nice and crispy and ready to go. Then I'll add the spinach in there, chop that up. Then I'll throw all of that in a wrap, grate some cheese over it, fry that up until it's nice and crispy. I like a crispier tortilla, that's just me personally. And then that's a solid lunch. I'm also aiming for a high protein diet here, you'll notice, but basically, I'm aiming for right around 0.7 to one gram of protein for every gram, for every pound of body weight that I have. So it varies depending on the day, but that's kind of what I'm aiming for. Sometime throughout the day, usually after a workout, I will also have a smoothie. These I absolutely love. I usually will use either almond or oat milk, fill that up so far. Then I'll do a handful of spinach a banana, sometimes two if I'm having a larger shake. And then I'll add a scoop and a bit of protein powder. So it's a little more than the usual scoop. It's like 25 grams. This is probably closer to like 30, 35. Add some of that high protein yogurt in again. And then I'll add a little bit of mint leaves just to kind of liven it up a bit. I find that really helps the flavor. Add some spinach. I think I already mentioned spinach. And then sometimes I'll add some berries too if I'm feeling that. So it's like your regular protein shake, but just elevated a little bit. Then throughout the day, I'll have a protein bar or two. I really like the Cliff Builders ones. That's just my personal taste. They are super expensive, so they hurt the wallet a bit, but they taste good. They keep me going, especially if I'm on a shoot day or something. Sometimes I'll throw one or two of those in my bag, keep me going, plus get that protein count in there. Then lastly, for dinner, I'll usually do a different, I'll usually gravitate between three different things, either classic chicken, rice, broccoli. I, I train a little bit in boxing, so that's kind of the staple boxer's diet is just chicken, rice, and broccoli. Or I'll do a nice steak. I'm actually thawing a couple now for my girlfriend and I to have dinner tonight. I'm gonna cook those up. And that's always a big fan favorite, just like in an eight ounce strip loin steak, cast iron pan, throw some garlic on there, really heavy on the garlic. And then I'll add the, I'll fry up some broccoli. I like giving it a nice little bit of char, just helps give it a little crispy flavor to it. Either some potato wedges, some mashed potatoes, something like that in there too, just to give all bases covered, break it up and give a really nice meal. And then honestly, I'll drink like two cups of black coffee, I'll drink a bunch of sparkling water. I could live off of black coffee and sparkling water, quite honestly. And then beyond that, like, here's the thing. I'm a model, right? And I work out often, but when I got signed, I didn't work out a ton and I didn't really care about my diet as much. And I've just started eating to feel better and to bulk up a bit and to help my muscles recover after a workout. And the, the fact of the matter is, I'm, I'm like my mid early 20s. I'm a lean guy. I have a really fast metabolism. So as far as like following a model diet, this is what I do to feel good, to replenish my muscles and to help me bulk up a little. This isn't like what's gonna lean you down because I'm, I'm not at a calorie deficit. I'm having more calories than I actually need and that I'm burning so I can 
bulk up to then get that muscle mass going. So that's kind of the idea that I have here. My metabolism is fast enough that realistically, I don't wanna brag or anything. I can pretty much eat whatever the frick I want, but I don't because I care about my body and I want it to look and feel good. So that's what I'm doing. And I want it to last a long time because you only get one and I'm gonna to try to treat it right. So that's kind of my philosophy for this and how and why I eat the way I do. And uh, then I'll have dessert. I'm not like a person that skips dessert, especially for the bulking thing. I encourage dessert, like yes, get dessert. And sometimes it's annoying because I'm like, I really don't wanna eat right now. Like I've eaten so much today, but then I'll eat, go a little more just to, just to hit that up. So that's, that's, that's my basic bare bones diet, pretty much every day, seven days a week. It, that's, that's, that's how it goes. If I eat out anywhere, so I'll sometimes go to like Chipotle or something like that, get a nice burrito, love that. And that's, that's about it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know if there's a lot of education in it. If there is, if you're a lean guy like me and you're looking to bulk up a bit, go to the gym a lot, maybe that'll help you. That's just a look into my routine, my weekly diet. And I hope you enjoyed it. So if you are new around here, consider subscribing. And as always, remember to work hard and rest often.